If you've been feeling a little bit far behind, join the club. Remember Bananarama sang about the cruel summer? Well, this has been a mean spring, but it looks like the crab apple is going to finally bloom, squeaked right through, and everywhere you look, bulbs are blooming. The bulbs on the patio are looking pretty good, and if you like bulbs and you like summer bulbs, it's time to get ready on those now. You can plant lilies in the ground or you can do them in pots. I'd like to do them in pots because that way they can be on the patio and I can appreciate them up close and have that wonderful fragrance. Now this is about the right size pot for them. If it's any smaller, they'll get too hot. If it's any bigger, they'll rot. So can you see this, this what is this? Three gallon, five gallon, I don't know. You can plant four or five in a pot this size and about five inches deep. And if they've sprouted like this, it is really important as you add the soil that you don't break them off. If you break them off, that is the end for this year. So be super careful and just dribble in the soil until you've got them all covered up. And now these can stay outside. These don't need to be protected in any way at this stage of the game. Nothing can beat cannas for that bold tropical look in the middle of summer. These are great looking rhizomes. You can plant cannas in beds or in pots, but no matter where you're gonna plant them, you've gotta start them first. This is not the pot that this is gonna grow in. It's the pot that it's gonna get started in. Put him in there, see that he sprouted, so you wanna make sure not to break that sprout off. And it's just a matter of gently packing in the soil. He'll be off and running pretty soon. Now, these cannot stay outside right now. It is just too cool at night. Leave them in a sunny window or, you know, I'm kinda out of sunny windows, so I have 80 cannas in my living room. It is now time for the annual tomato lecture. It is too early to plant tomatoes and it will be for quite some time. Tomatoes are tropical plants and they really can't stand cold temperatures. So it's irrelevant if it's 80 degrees during the day, it's the nighttime temperatures that matter. So if it is staying reliably at 50 degrees at night, fine. Plant tomatoes, but otherwise wait. Now I just potted these up yesterday as a matter of fact. So I've got Unicorn, Park Swapper, and Big Yummy, who could resist a tomato called Big Yummy. They're right on track to be planted in two, three weeks, depending on the weather forecast. So just remember, do you wanna sleep outside when it's 38 degrees? I mean, seriously.